is creepy. What is that sound? Is it Illuminati? Oh my god, what the hell? Okay. Let's get back up in the morning. Guess at eight. I forgot about the alarm. Time to clock. get up already? Nuts. <gasps> there goes my phone. What happened to my phone? <gasps> Wait a second. What's this? Oh my god. Yeah, Looks I got like Danielle my did first get a second a. note from the black cat. Wait. Oh, that wasn't mine. Oh my god. I got uh Oklahoma. <laughs> Okay. Ah! Hey, guess who just got a note from the black cat? Congratulations. Just don't go all Danielle on me, okay? <sighs> Stay away from closets. <laughs> don't worry. Y'all. The fuck? So we just saw an Illuminati Someone meeting. Someone didn't lock their door. Oh my god, it's snowing. That's so cute. Oh god, I'm scared. <gasps> Haha! -ha. Evidence. That's so cute! It's snowing now! It's Christmas! Reminds me of Hogwarts and Christmas time. Lena! Lena! No! Stop it! Lena! No! No! Lena's trying to tear down the green screen. She's being bad. Oh my god. I got a message. They're still gossiping about me. <laughs> They're saying I left France because of my boyfriend problems. That's hilarious. Let's see. This girl is my main suspect for this Illuminati bullshit. How's it going? Is this barrette yours by any chance? I found it outside. It's not mine, but I know whose it probably is. Who? Little Miss I'm So Goth, I'm Cool, Mel. She, oh my god. I'll catch you later. No problem. She's gothphobic. Someone didn't lock their How door. Is this by any chance your barrette? Oh, she wears yeah, the bows. Is. Hey, thanks for finding it. I don't know why I bother with these things. They're always falling out of my hair. I know. This one fell out of your hair at that cloak and dagger meeting you were at last night. <laughs> oh my night. god. What meeting? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I was watching Mel from up in the oak tree. I saw you. <laughs> I'm not She's going shocked. to tell you anything, so whatever you think you saw, just forget it. So it's Nancy's okay if I text feisty. everybody about what I think I saw? <laughs> now look, whatever yes. you tell me will go no further than this room, I promise. I'm not looking for something to gossip about. I just want to know what's going on with you, that's all. Oh, I'm her best friend. What you saw was a meeting of the Blackwood Society. It's a secret club that someone at Waverly started a couple of years after the school was founded. Only seven girls a year get chosen to be members. What does the Blackwood Society do? We just meet. There's no talking or socializing. <laughs> we just we literally meet. just stand around for about 20 minutes and chant. It's more like a tradition, one that keeps going even though everybody's it. forgotten how and why it started. Everything's totally anonymous. Everyone wears a black cloak, except for the leader. Hers is light blue, and no one ever talks. They just whisper, so you can't tell who anyone is. About once a month, I'll get a note or a text saying there's a meeting that night. Who's the leader? I have no idea. Probably a senior, though. Look, to me, belonging to the Blackwood Society is cool. Not because it's secret and exclusive and all that, but because I like being part of something that someone a long time ago, for whatever reason, thought was important. I like not knowing what the chant means, and I accept all the secrecy and anonymity hmm. because by doing so, I get to be part of a tradition that's more than a century old. I'm sure some girls belong because they're too intimidated to quit, but I belong because the unknown is something I've always felt drawn to. Anyway, that's it. That's all you're going to get me to say on the matter. I do trust her, but also with a grain of salt. <laughs> Do you think there's any connection between the Blackwood Society and all this black cat stuff? I meant what I said before. Blackwood Society? Never heard of it. I'd better get going. Sounds good. 
<gasps> okay, someone just texted me that I need to go check out the student body president Izzy's room. Locked. Izzy must be somewhere else. I thought the coast was clear. President's room. Okay, I think it's where the map is. Maybe. Nope. <laughs> think you could give me a hint? Hints are my middle name. There's a room or two around here that I'd very much like to get into. Been waiting Only for I don't this. have a key, if you get my drift. Check the school's website and see if anyone there has recently had a similar problem. And if so, what they did to ID a solution. Sounds good. Thanks for your help. My pleasure. See you, Nan. <gasps> Bye. Should I use my ID? Where do I get a student ID? Mm. Uh, never mind. What if I use Oklahoma? Nope. <laughs> that did not work. Oh my god. Oh crap. That's memory. Do I get anything for beating this? No. Okay, I'm looking up how to get into that map room because I give up. My good old friend, the message boards. Oh, okay. So I need to look into... It looks like I've ignored that I need to look into dining etiquette or something. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Rachel has it, yes. Rachel has it. I'm here! Someone didn't lock their door. What? Listen, I know you checked out a book on Victorian dining, but I was wondering if okay. I could borrow it. We're moving I'm kind of into Victorian stuff. Sorry, I need it for the paper I'm writing. But I'll tell you what, if you get my math notebook from Mel, I'll work on that project for a while, and you can borrow the Victorian book. I know Mel's just down the hall, but... I'd rather not have to deal with her, okay? Sure. One math notebook coming up. Great. I'm here. How about that? What's this the word? door's not locked. I need to get Rachel's math notebook from you. Sure. Soon as I remember where I put it. Nuts, I left it in the library. That's all right. I can go get it. Why do you want her math notebook? Well, actually, Rachel, uh... She wants it, but she didn't want to ask me for it in person. It's almost like she's afraid of you. I don't treat her any differently than I treat practically everyone else around here. In other words, for the most part, I totally ignore her. <laughs> I don't know what her problem is. I'll let you get back to your music. She's rude. Drop in this girl's the best. People are just afraid of her goth look. So we know where the lost and found is. Something but... tells me I don't see Rachel's math book anywhere because it wound up in here. There you go. Ha! Ha! You've got my math notebook. Fab, I'll take what that. What did you have against my best friend? What do you have against Mel? Nothing. She's one of the few girls around here I actually kind of like. But before, you said you didn't want to deal with her. You misunderstood. I meant I didn't have time to deal with her because of these stupid papers I have to write. Anyway, the book's all yours. Go ahead and take it. Finally. I gotta get back to work here. I'll see you later. Okay. This is moving. So right now we're trying to figure out etiquette. <gasps> yes! 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 Okay. We got an ID to break into places, basically. <laughs> um, yes, 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 yes! Oh my god! I'm snooping. Oh god, this is shady. Okay. Oh my god, this is... Ew, this is a guy. <laughs> That's Jacob. Okay. <gasps> yes, a key to something. Anything else in here? <gasps> is this it? <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I'm straight up this robbing her. This is the cloak her. the leader of the Blackwood <gasps> Society She's was wearing. She's the leader? 
Okay, so we know she's the leader of the cult. I don't see the Edgar Allan Poe book. Oh, shit. What? This is the book that's missing from the library. If I return it, I'll get credit points. Whoa. Has some code in there. Okay, I think we're done snooping. Now we gotta get into that map room. Probably solve the puzzle. So in summary, I've gotten a note from the black cat. Myself, I've been threatened, targeted, sneaking into places. Miss Sawyer, you are in ten demerits worth of trouble. Excuse me? Oh no, I got expelled. This is some bullshit. What? <laughs> These messages. Okay, so the idea is... I gotta sneak in at night, don't I? Wait, I need to confront Izzy real quick, actually. I need to tell her I found out she's the leader of the Illuminati. How's it going? Seeing as you're the leader of the Blackwood Society, I need you to tell me something. All right, who blabbed? I... look, that's not important. I just <laughs> need to hear that chant you My guys repeat, friend. word for word. The reason why is very complicated, but I promise you, whatever you tell me, I won't repeat it to anyone, ever. What's in it for me? If you don't tell me what I want to know, I'll tell everyone about the society. Blackmail. Maybe I don't care. I'll owe you one. How's that? I'll say it once, and that's all. Three is fine, but five is more. Even nineteen defeats four. Should just seven become lore, at least two will find the door. Five, you nine. owe me big. What does the chant mean? I have no idea. It's been passed down verbatim since the school and the society was founded. That's absolutely all I know about it. Everything is secret. Like that cloak? I got a text telling me to go to a certain spot. And when I did, there was the blue cloak along with a note saying I was to choose seven new members and in the spring, a new leader. Everyone takes a vow of secrecy. Everyone thinks if they break it, they'll be cursed or something. You believe that? No harm in hedging your bets. And since you're in on the secret now too, you should probably do the same. Well, now that that conversation's over, forever, what else is going on? Thanks for all the advice. Adios. Okay, so she's a leader. She gave me the chant. I also need to figure out this utensil nonsense. I don't know how to get in there. Okay, so let's go to bed. Okay. It's quietly. Oh god, this is stressful. I'm in. I'm in. This is scary. I'm gonna get caught. I'm scared to get caught. Oh, I need a photo of this. Uh, camera. Okay. Whew. Anything else in here? Don't I have a book about this? Okay, not that one. <laughs> uh, this one. Uh, okay, so tail, bill, wrist. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> oh no, what have I done? Oh no, what have I done? <laughs> Oh god, so I have to rebuild the entire United States. Great. Where... I, I don't know what Mississippi... This is where I struggle most with United States geography. Where does Delaware go? There. Oh. Wow, I did it. Nice. That's 
Rachel, what's she up to? I should probably find out. If I don't find out why Rachel was sneaking around like that now, I may never get another chance. Here, let's try the ID trick. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, Y'all. What was that? Oh my god. What is this? Oh no. I failed. So I think I have to hit all of them. It looks like I'm not supposed to slide over the places where the lines cross more than once. Oh my god, this is so hard. <laughs> I think I got it. <gasps> I got it. Oh my god. It's a secret passage. Oh my god. Oh ah! my gosh. There's two of you? Please don't tell. You mean oh you both go to school here, but a everyone gag. thinks just one of you does? <gasps> including the administration? But we're not hurting anyone. I mean, it's not like anyone else was going to use this room or eat these leftovers. We've been doing this for years, Becca. If we were doing any harm, we would have been found out by now. Our mother's dead, and our father was clueless when it came to raising two girls by himself. We were afraid that unless we somehow went off to boarding school, we'd wind up in foster homes. So we applied for scholarships all over the place, but this was the only one we got. So we decided to share it. And we've These only girls got are one more crazy. Semester. Just one. We're so close. Please don't tell Becca. Please. Wow. This is amazing. Okay, I won't tell. And don't worry. I'm pretty good with secrets. Thank you. I just can't believe I'm the only one who knows. Actually, you're not. Kim! Someone Kim. else found out and blackmailed us into leaving those black cat notes for other people. You two are the black cat? No, we just make the notes and deliver them to whomever the real black cat tells us to. What are you doing? If she tells, they're gonna kick us out anyway, Rachel. She may as well know everything. Maybe she'll even I help us. I wanna know everything. So you're Rachel and you're Kim? Right. How does this blackmailer black cat person communicate with you? Email. Each time is from a different address. We have no idea who's sending them. Well, I guess I could kind of, you know, play detective and try Nancy, to find out who it is. Subtle. That would be so cool. Then we'd know something that person doesn't want anyone to find out. A stalemate. Yes! In the meantime, my sister needs <laughs> to finish her dinner and you should go. Nobody cares if one of us isn't around, but if the new girl suddenly disappears... I understand. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I mean, I'll see one of you guys tomorrow. Night. I hate this girl, and now there's two of them. Oh crap! I didn't do my snack job yesterday. Whoops. I think I need to do these utensils stuff, which I'm not looking forward to. Oh shit, it's really snowing. I can't talk now. Girl, I know your secret. You can't talk. <gasps> oh my god, are you... <laughs> I had to turn on the light. I'm so mad. I bet that's the key to the cabinet. Well, I found the key to the cabinet. That's what's important. Here. We go. Yay! We did it. Okay. 
now. <laughs> okay, let me copy this menu down. Okay, I copied that on the menu. Now I need to look up this dining book. Got it. Heck yeah. Now what? <laughs> now I have four going. So I think this has something to do with not that. Uh this. Like what are these numbers? Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14. Oh, I can't crack this code. <laughs> like, look at all these notes. <laughs> I might need some help on this. Comment below. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, I'm gonna look this up. Okay, I'm getting distracted by shopping. Um, okay. I literally put them in the right place. Okay, so I looked up the answer and it makes zero cents. So I think I, I have to put these in chronological order and then from there check the placement of each story. <gasps> okay. I cheated, but it, uh, it was too hard. I still don't get how it was supposed to work. Ooh. This must be the photo of Rita Hollowell and her cat that Rachel was hoping I'd find. I need to take a picture of this so I can upload it to the website along with the other icon photos. Rachel is going to be thrilled. I hope I don't get murdered. I feel like the end is coming. The climax. Becca, hey, you finished the icon pictures. You even found that picture of Hollowell and her cat. Great job. There's just one more thing I need you to do, and then so you'll be done. Ungrateful ho. I had to uh, crack this code that I it? didn't even crack. One of my web pages has to include the essay Corrine wrote that won the English department's coveted pen to paper award. So get a copy of it from her and upload it to the site, and that'll be that. Any idea who the real black cat is yet? No, but don't worry. I'm working on it. My sister says I shouldn't get my hopes up, but I can't help it. Now I can question her. Would you happen to know anything about the official blueprints of the school that are missing from the library? They're missing? So you've seen them? That's how I knew this room connected to the attic, but I don't have them and I have no idea who does. Hmm. Now that I've seen you and your sister together, I'm pretty sure I can tell you That's apart. That's not accurate for That's myself. That's impossible! We're exactly the same, right down to our handwriting. No one can tell us apart. Oh, God. You're Rachel, aren't you? You just guessed. Your sister does this hair-tucking thing. You're probably so used to seeing her do it that you have no idea you don't. Thanks for the tip. That test you flunked. What I don't happened? Know. I just guessed. See, my sister attends some classes and I attend others. AP Chemistry was one of hers. So one day, she got sick, and to avoid her getting an absence to merit, I went in her place. And naturally, that was the day the teacher decided to surprise the class with a test. Needless to say, I failed miserably. I've got to get back to work. Uh-oh. Now what's happened? <gasps> Something happened to Izzy. Oh my god. I need this paper. What's up, Rumi? For the web page I'm helping Rachel put up, I need to get the essay you wrote that won the pen to paper award. Oh yeah, Rachel mentioned that. I didn't think my paper was that great, but for some reason the entire faculty went totally gaga over it. <laughs> I'll copy it onto a flash drive for you. But while I do that, would you do me a favor? Sure, I guess. I'm absolutely starving, and since you're snack shop boss, how about getting me a toasted bagel with cheese, an apple, some juice, and a candy bar, okay? Soon as you do, I'll give you the essay. 
fish? You got it. Excellent. <gasps> Guess who just got a second note from oh, the black no. cat? Ooh, you're in for it. I got another note. We know it's the twins, though. But... Get that favor you owe me? You can <gasps> return it right now by finding out what happened to my term paper. It's not on my computer anymore. When did you discover that? When I got back from breakfast, I turned my computer on, and nothing was there. It's like my whole hard drive's been erased. Four weeks of research Four and weeks. writing are just gone. I'm going to have to start all over and turn it in late, which means no A for the course, and no... Somebody deliberately did this to me, and I want to know who, so you find out. Until you do, just leave me alone. Oh, God. Okay, she's mad. I gotta do my snacks. There. All done. Yay! You've got my snack. Yep. Enjoy. Everyone Thank uses me you. for snacks. Mmm. That is so good. Here. Keep it as long as you want. The essay is the only thing on there. Great. Thanks. Whoa. When it comes to Mr. Poe and maybe Miss... Or should I say Nurse Hollowell, looks like Corrine's a bit of an expert. Interesting. Hey, Becca, thanks for uploading that essay. Why did you send me that note? What note? I got a note from the black cat. A second note. I, I didn't send it. We didn't send it. The first one, yes, but that was it. If you got another note, it must be from the real black cat. <gasps> Look, I don't have any more assignments for you, so thanks for all your help. What the... Ooh, I got a credit. Good. Oh, I need to talk to Corinne about her knowledge. Corinne, you here? Guess not. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Y'all... She knows her password. It's Queen B1. <laughs> She's so full of herself. Okay, so this is the if you if you're not following, this is the password to Izzy's computer, who Izzy just got hacked and her paper was erased, if you recall. Um uh, now that implies Corinne is in the cellar, perhaps. I'm a little spooked. Concerned. Um, I'm scared. Go in here. What is that noise? Sounds like it's coming from the other side of the wall. Oh my god. That's interesting. <gasps> the old set of blueprints shows a tiny room behind the furnace, which isn't on the modern blueprints. Oh you guys. And close. the modern blueprint includes a drawing of the furnace and a bunch of numbered valves. Dupin? I've seen that name before in Hollowell's journal. Okay, okay, okay. I found 3, 5, 19, 4, 7. 7 is red. 2. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god. This is it. Oh my god, this is it. I'm scared. Cameron. Well, I think I'm on the climax. Yeah? Oh my god, I know. Kareem? Ah! What are you doing here? Apparently the same thing you are. Oh god. Looking for the treasure her. Rita Hollowell hid. Is that it? What is it? An old manuscript? By Edgar Allan Poe. Never published. He told her where it was when he was on his deathbed. When he died, she took it and ran off so Rufus Griswold wouldn't end up with it. At least I think that's what happened. You Reese found Hodder. all that out while you were researching that paper? When I do research, I do research. Although truth be told, all I knew with relative certainty is that she'd hidden something in this building. I wasn't sure where. Which is why you became the Black Cat. I'm not the Black Cat. I didn't leave those notes. <gasps> no, you blackmailed someone else into doing that for you. Two someone's actually. Oh my god. You're pretty smart. The question is, are you smart enough to live to tell the tale? I don't think so. 
Oh my god, yeah, I'm caught. <gasps> what the fuck is that? Oh my god, I'm gonna get my head chopped off. Oh god. to die with my head chopped off. I'm just kind of choosing whatever. Panicking. Okay, I failed again. solve this with this pressure. <gasps> I'm dead! I died. <laughs> yeah, and very violently I can only assume. I really have to pee so that doesn't help. <gasps> I did it! Oh my god! I don't even know how I did that. <gasps> oh my god. I gotta go get her. No, forget it. You're not going anywhere till you tell me what the heck is going yes. on. Come yes. on, Mel. It's too long a story. I need to go. You my just entered friend. my room through the wall. I want an explanation. I'll explain later. Now let me past. Stay right <gasps> there, Mel. You too? <laughs> what is this? Well, for Corrine, it's over. Because of all the meticulous research she'd done, Corrine knew Rita Hollowell had hidden something written by Poe somewhere in Ramsey Hall. But without the clues that my investigation eventually uncovered, her only hope of finding it was by searching the entire building. And she couldn't do that unless most, if not all, of its occupants spent midterm break elsewhere, leaving their rooms unoccupied. So, she resurrected an old Waverly legend and attempted to frighten her classmates away with notes from the Black Cat, followed by well-timed accidents. And, having stumbled upon Rachel and Kim's secret months before, she blackmailed them into writing and delivering the notes for her, so that, if anything went wrong, they would take the blame. But thanks to me, and to Mel, who wouldn't even let me out of her room until I told her everything, Corrine got the blame and was promptly expelled, which is kind of too bad. She would no doubt have graduated at the top of her class if her greed, guile, and subconscious desire to retaliate against her classmates hadn't gotten the best of her. But some good did result from all this. For one thing, Megan's parents dropped their threatened lawsuit and allowed her to return to school. Fully recovered from her allergic reaction, she threw herself into her studies with a vengeance. Now, with Kareen out of the picture, the valedictorian contest has turned into an academic knockdown dragout between Izzy, Leela, Mel, and Megan. Which is a good thing. Not pretty, but good. Anyway, as for Rachel and Kim, Kareen made sure they got expelled too. But when some of Waverly's more influential alumni heard what had happened, they insisted the twins be unexpelled and even paid their tuition and board for the rest of the year. What privilege. They contended that the audacious fraud Rachel and Kim had perpetrated stemmed from their determination to get a good education and hence should be rewarded, not punished. And you know, I have the feeling Rita Hollowell and maybe even her idol Mr. Poe, who was pretty darn good at making fiction seem like fact himself, would have very much agreed. We finished. So, it was kind of fucked up they made the black girl the bad guy. You know, this sh doesn't seem right. So, right now it's asking us a quiz. This one's very obvious. The music was there the whole time. 
let's see what awards I got. Oh, I got achievements. Okay, I got very few awards. I got the gossip award. That's all that matters. And my piano practice. Oh my god. I enjoy this game for just the teen drama of it. I do think it's dated and how, you know, it's kind of sexist and how it treats like girls, all girl schools, all girl, girl relationships and drama and things like that. I definitely recognize that and it is kind of racist I feel like at the end that they made the black girl the villain which is shitty. It has fun characters. I love my shout out to my girl goth girl Mel. It's my best friend in this game. Shout out to the message boards for giving me a couple hints. I got by with without many hints though. I'm pretty proud of that. Back in the day when I was a kid I was not so good. Thanks for watching this series. I'm ashamed of having four stars here out <laughs> of how many. But we did it. We made it through the journey. But that was fun. Thanks for joining me. Subscribe for more gaming, makeup, and miscellaneous content. Bye. The Waverly Academy Founders. Ooh, what a stuffy group. What is this? Hey! It's like bloopers. The black hat strikes again. We all tried, but none of us were ever able to snatch the pebble from her hand. Now, <laughs> should I put this in the oops pile or the I'm so very sorry pile? I the setting on my flash news. might be just a little too strong. <gasps> Shade at her being pale? Oh my god. <laughs> I must have been going through an abstract phase at the time. Way us off, graduation cat. I need more of that, Nancy. What the heck? <laughs> Goodbye.